Greg Newsom's a player who's flown up draft boards over the last month or so, and when you throw on the tape, it's so easy to see why. His height, weight, speed combination at the corner position is through the roof, and the film is excellent too. He's great in cover two. You can see the potential in a cover three look. So let's jump into the film. The play I want to start today is against Ohio State, and it's just showing off his vision and understanding in cover two. So he's at the top of the screen here. And what you're going to see as we roll it through is how well he gets hands on the receiver, redirects him, and then gets depth as Fields breaks the pocket. So let's break it down slowly. You're going to see here, after about two or three yards, he gets hands on the receiver, pushes him to the, the sideline, and as he escapes his zone, he passes him off. But as Fields breaks the pocket and breaks contain, he gets more depths. What he's doing here is making sure he doesn't have that throw past the sticks as the underneath linebacker takes the crossing tight end or wide receiver. From there, he identifies that man's taken, drives on the football, and makes a play for the pass breakup. Let's watch it one more time. Good redirection, depth, understands that Fields breaks the pocket, and then that closing speed and makes a play on the ball. Fantastic football play. I love that from Greg Newsom. This one here might be the best play he put on film throughout the entire 2020 season. That was only four and a half games, but this one really stood out. He's at the top of the screen in off coverage, and this is his ability to recover. This is where athleticism at the receiver position, sorry, the corner position, is so crucial. Here, there's a little double move. You see right here, the receiver starts to break it down and Newsom goes to bite. But look how fluidly he flips those hips gets back on track, finds the ball, and makes the play on the football. This is fantastic corner play. Again, watch it a little slower. The wide receiver makes his move. Newsom plants his foot. He's coming downhill. Look how effortlessly he turns those hips, gets back upfield, and as always, he finds the football and he gets hands on it. I love that play. That is elite corner play from Greg Newsom. And you see this uh, tendency and abilities in man coverage Time and time again, people talk about him as a cover two corner and he's terrific in that scheme, but the flexibility and versatility of his game is evident when you watch it closely. This one here, just a great example of how well he stays uh, in the hip pocket of the receiver. Even though he loses a step, it's closing speed. You're going to hear me talk about this three, four, five times as we go through this review. Greg Newsom's closing speed and length is just overwhelming at the catch point. Let's watch this one. Bottom of the screen, Greg Newsom in off coverage. Little slant against him. Little slow, recover, closing speed, and makes a play on the ball. Again, gets a yard or two of separation at the break. Newsom is quick, though, to stay in that hip pocket. The ball's in the perfect location. Man, that's impressive play. Another pass breakup from Greg Newsom. Just a little one here and nothing super exciting. I just wanted to, to really highlight how well he stays in phase in man coverage. He's at the bottom of the screen here, off coverage again. You just see, flips his hips, turns his head, stays in phase the entire time. Everything's so fluid and effortlessly. The way he goes from his back pedal to his transition step, I love it. So let's go through one last play, and I'm going to ask you to squint really carefully. I know the sun is a bit of a killer here, but this really shows how good Greg Newsom can be in man coverage. One thing I will say about when he's in press, he doesn't use his hands a lot, and I'd like to see him use his hands more. He's at the top of the screen here in the, uh, the little area of sunlight, but just watch his pants. That's probably the best way to locate him. He's so good at staying in the hip pocket of the receiver, making a play on the football. It's a good throw. It's better coverage. Greg Newsom makes a ton of plays on the ball. His pass breakup numbers were outstanding, both in 2019 and in 2020. I love him in a cover two scheme, but also he definitely has the ability to play in a single high look, like Robert Sala's defense here in New York. I wouldn't be at all surprised if he's in serious contention to be the pick at number 23. Greg Newsom's